My name is Argo Bhattacharya. Basically, I'm a professor at the Department of Economics. Uh, I a little bit of my educational background. I finished my PhD from the University of California, Irvine. Uh, before that, I did my master's in quantitative economics from the Indian Statistical Institute, Kolkata, and a bachelor's degree in economics from Jadavpur University. Uh, Research-wise, uh, my work is broadly in the area of monetary economics so basically I study uh, what broadly constitutes money um, uh, especially money's role as a medium of exchange and as a, a store of value uh, so money for a lot of people is, uh, uh, is is a noun like a piece of paper we call them money call, call it money uh, but for me money is more of an adjective uh, like good and bad and then we can talk about how good or how bad something is so money is an adjective that we assign to certain uh, tokens whether tangible or uh, something that's virtual and we can talk about the moneyness of those different uh, tokens or assets so basically what I'm talking about is liquidity people keep talking about data science now it's uh, it seems like it's mostly computer science uh, you know, programming in R, Python, MATLAB, you know, Tableau, all, all sorts of programming languages. But uh, you just uh, you not only need uh, programming to analyze data, I mean, you need programming to analyze data, but you also need to make sense of the data. And that's also where economics is important. And a lot of economics, uh, you know, modern economics is at the intersection of economics and computer science. So even in Ashoka, a couple of months ago, we had a workshop on uh, economics and uh, you know uh, workshop between economics department and the computer science department. That's something I really like about Ashoka that people are inquisitive, people are ready to push their limits, uh, and, and I'm a tough teacher, uh, so I really encourage them uh, to push the limits, and students are ready to do that. So my area of work is at the intersection of monetary economics and uh, the liquidity theory of finance. Uh, and what I basically study is the different costs of holding, uh, you know, different classes of assets, uh, including money, uh, and the interaction with the macroeconomy.